Uh, you know, that's the number to call if you want this house. Put a 704 in front of it. I'm back on a cul-de-sac on lot 22 with a Midland address, which is east of Charlotte. And this is like really caught my attention today. They're taking very good use of this. And I know that that beautiful Cedarvale farm, uh, I'm going to call it a pond, a lake. It's got fish in it. It's right around the corner. Now, you've got another house here with a long driveway back here, but that one is sold. You do have some power lines coming through here, but you do want electricity, right? <laughs> anyway, I like that it's set way back off of this cul-de-sac. Nice long driveway and a beautiful house. This is a five bedroom house with four baths. Come on, people. It's priced in the 360 to 375 range. Big porch, nice and generous and uh, good looking column stone. It's just really nicely appointed and it is beautiful for sure. So let's take a tour of this house. Sometimes my YouTube subscribers remind me, hey Roger, you like light in the back when you walk in, right? I said, yeah, and if you're not a subscriber, please uh, click the uh, ring the bell so you'll be notified of new videos as you do subscribe. So we've got a formal up in the front, beautiful nine foot ceilings. Century Communities has been in the marketplace for a few years. By the way, these, uh, gl this glass will be uh, clear, but you've got a great looking office here. The long driveway set back in a cul-de-sac. So if you work remotely, this is ideal. And you got that formal, very, very typical floor plan. You come in, it's got the open concept that we all want. I like the fact that the stairway is not just staring you in the face, and many of you like that too. This is in the 3,300 to 3,400 square foot range, closer to 3,400. Looks like woods in the back. Wow, look at that island, man. So Century Communities, who are they? Large national builder, found a way into the Charlotte market not long ago, and uh, they've got some decent land position, that's for sure, and they're being aggressive about it. Now these are 42 inch cabinets. For some people, the dark cabinets are a deal breaker, but maybe not for you. Uh, and if you want this house with light cabinets, we can do it, but not on this lot, baby, because this one is priced so right. 42 inch cabinets, that is generous. So it's that open concept plan. It does have a guest suite on the main level, so there's a lot to love on that wise. And let's see if we can get out on this uh, patio and see what we got here. Oh yeah, you got a nice size pad, and it looks like you could probably put a lanai here or uh, it looks like maybe even some sort of roof system if you wanted to enclose this in. But man, you've got woods back there, pool, playground here. This is beautiful. So it's really a nice white hardy plank type material. That is a good looking thing. And then the floor is a nice dark walnut. So this is a quick move home, people, and I would love to be your buyer's agent on it. If you uh, just got news, in fact, I'm in the neighborhood today because I've got some folks that have been looking at a house from another builder, <clears throat> Bonterra is in here also. Whoops, did I say Bonterra? What I meant was Taylor Morrison. Bonterra, now this is a laundry room and it's dark, but that is the laundry room. But uh, Taylor Morrison obviously bought out Bonterra. <clears throat> and so Taylor Morrison and Century Communities are here in Cedarvale Farm, or is it Cedarvale Farms? Depends on whether you look at the sign on the front or whether you look at the MLS. And by the way, here's a, clear little picture of that nice dark floor. It looks like a dark walnut to me. Then you've got, there's no electricity on, but you've got a full bath right there next to it and stuff like that. Places for furniture, little niches, got a closet and all that goes out to the garage. So let's jump upstairs. What have we seen so far? A formal off to the left and to the right, formal dining room and a study. Big bank of windows guys, plenty of light coming in. Nine foot ceilings, we have carpet on the stairs. Now, my first question is, where is Jack the real estate dog when you need him on a video? Jack E did not come to work with me today. Oh yeah, you come up and you got this great looking loft. I mean, for the price guys, to have five bedrooms and four full baths, and here's one of the reasons I love this neighborhood. Uh, I love Cedarville Farm because it is like, it's, you feel like you're going into the country. You know, you, which, which, where you're living is basically not that far from 485 and uh, Albemarle Road, which is exit 41. Well, this is a big room, guys. It's not that far, but you're going through the country. You feel like you're passing a lot of stuff that where your stress levels are going down even as you're moving. So uh, there's a, there are a lot of reasons to love it. And again, as you've often heard me say, now see the frame mirrors, little extra things like that, nice. And then the undermount sinks, 
Very good looking. I'm not sure whether that's cultured marble or because they're making some amazing cultured marble these days that sort of look like quartz. But this is pretty all the way up. And so I would just encourage you to give me a call at 704. Ooh, this big, baby. Ooh, 704-345-3400. If you're interested in this one, this is on lot number 22. There's a commode room off to my right. But again, guys, this is, has a sense of spaciousness. You could put a lot of extra furniture in here besides just a king-size bed, that's for sure. So that loft is neat. A lot of memories are going to be made here in this room. I believe that for sure. This is a great house. You've got kids and maybe even multi-generational. If your parents and or grandparents need a place, think about it. Uh-oh, whoever gets the best grades gets this room because this has got an ensuite bath, lots of windows and light overlooking the trees on the cul-de-sac. I can't even count the bedrooms. I'm reading the sheet. It says five. So, but that's an ensuite bath. That's really nice. And then I got you. Then you've got a Jack and Jill scenario. Let's look out the front window for a second. You got some nice woods over there. Oh, there's the, is that, that's the lake right there, isn't it? I thought it was nearby. I didn't think it was right that close. I think that's it right there. Man, that's pretty. Walk over there and do some fishing, baby. <clears throat> so give me a call at 704-345-3400. Closet off to the right. Your bathtub and commode in the middle of the Jack and Jill. And then you've got another sink and bedroom combo. Uh, I would love to be your buyer's agent, and you know the way it works, right? If you go in to call the sales center or the internet advisor, they work for and have the best interest of the seller uh, at heart, and my job is to help you and get you the best transaction as your agent, and typically they pay uh, us adequately, but there are a couple of builders that are, uh, there's another new build, uh, another established builder that just popped up and is starting to treat the real estate agent commissions pretty bad. So. There's one that's done that for a long time, and I'm really shocked this last week uh, at what this other major builder is offering us. So I'm just kind of working through all that in my own head and heart. Give me a call at 704-345-3400. In other words, let me do it for you and let them pay me for my services. I'd love to be your buyer's agent.